another sell with Manimal vlog. This is a special one. This is a home tour. We're here at 5248 La Crescenta in Rancho Santa Fe. This is a seven bed, seven and a half bath, little under 10,000 square feet. It just hit the market. And I just want to say thanks to my good friend Jorge for letting us do this video. And we're taking team pictures today. So you'll see some uh, equipment in there. You'll see the photographer in there but that's not gonna stop us from taking a look at this amazing property. Again, just listed two days ago for 11.1 million out here in Rancho Santa Fe. Come on, let's take a look at it. Just the main entrance of this property is simply breathtaking. The size of this store is insane. I mean, you don't have a nicer grand entrance than this. And just the floors, the way they were laid down, you walk straight into kind of your foyer, uh, your sitting area. Uh, amazing, uh, by the way, this property is a single story home, 10,000 square feet, single story home. Let's walk on over here. We'll start on this side of the house, which is just, I mean, the whole property is amazing. You have big windows, super high ceilings. Can't go wrong with this. Here's uh, Roberto from, uh, he's taking the pictures today for the team. He's, Hi guys. he's getting some good video footage as well. Let's head on over here. We'll start on this side of the house. And this is really your family room. This is where you spend the most amount of time uh, at, in any home, really. It's a family room mixed in with the kitchen, obviously open concept uh, kitchen where you can uh, dine and entertain and really have friends over. But there's more to it than that. I mean, it's, it's really just the, the nucleus of the house and you can't go wrong with a kitchen this size, this nice. You have your double fridge, uh, monogram, double fridge there, Thermador uh, stove top, really, really high end appliances. I mean, just the white oak floors with the mixture of just earth tone colors in this property. I can already, you know, envision a family living here, spending Christmas here, spending the New Year's, and really just growing. I mean, you have a, a lot of room to grow in this property. Let's, uh, let's head on over here, which, it's pretty amazing. I just saw this house uh, or walked through this house about 10 minutes ago. And this is, this hallway is breathtaking. Walk over here, again, single story, 20 foot ceilings, makes the house feel way bigger. But just look at this amazing wall. You have white oak honeycomb wall. Doesn't this look amazing? By the way, this is more like the, uh, kids wing because you do have uh, a playroom and then you have uh, good sized bedrooms for the kids and then the master is on the other side of the house. Again, like I said, you have three bedrooms on this side. You have one, two, and then this one, which is really more, I wanna say it's more like a playroom, just the odd shaped size of the bedroom. Um, and then you have a black wall here, a chalk wall that you can just scribble and do whatever you want with it. And then if you look on that end of the house or the, the wall, th these are actually um, foam walls, so sound. So you can have a rock band in here and it's soundproof uh, the wall, which is pretty nice. And if you're wondering what this is, this is the uh, soundproofing of this room as well. You have foam uh, door there. On Heading back to the other wing of the house, going past the beautiful white oak honeycomb walls. I mean, you have the garage here, which I don't know if I showed you any guys out there, y'all wanna see the garage. To be honest, not much to the garage itself. You, ha you can have two cars here, two cars on that side. So it's a total four car garage, but you do have a huge driveway that you can you know, park 10, 15 cars. So you have a lot of guests over, you have that space to do it. have your laundry room in here. Good size laundry room, washer, dryer, and then of course a sink. You can't go wrong with a sink. Every laundry room needs a sink. Let's head on back. Let's walk on, uh, walk on over to the other side. We're gonna up here really quickly, halfway through the walk to the master bedroom. There's another bedroom in here. Again, what I really, really like about this bedroom is they continued the white oak flooring up onto the wall. Now, I don't know if you can see it through the camera, but this is actually a secret door that leads into your bathroom. 
good sized bathroom too. I mean, the bathrooms here, the closets in each of the bedrooms are really, really good size. It honestly seems like it's, every bedroom is an ensuite bedroom, which it is. I think most of them are in here. Lighting in here, you know, the chandeliers, the, uh, the roof, how it just, you know, uh, it's done very, very well done, very exquisite. This house was built in 2007, but it was recently renovated. And I think this would be, apart from the master bedroom and the bathroom and the closet, I think this is my favorite room in the house. You have a green office. I love the color green and obviously this is a very tastefully done green. If you say, oh, I want a green office in my house, you'd probably think, oh man, like a green office? Like really, that's, you know, I, I couldn't imagine it. Well, when I think of green office, this is exactly what I'm thinking. Very, very tastefully done. Just imagine working from home from this office. You do have access to the backyard. So if you want to take phone calls out there, you can. If you have uh, clients or anyone that you're meeting at your house that you want to bring into your office, they can come in through that door. Let's head on over here. You have another bedroom on this side of the house. So what's great and what I really like about, again, the property was, it was actually really well thought out. Why do I say that is because you do, even though you have the, the master bedroom on one wing, on, on one side of the house and they have three bedrooms on the other, you have this bedroom, which if, you know, families out there, parents, you know, if you have a baby, you want a nursery, really close to your master bedroom, this could be it. If you have a newborn baby, they can sleep here right next to the master bedroom, which we're gonna uh, visit right now. Just take a look at this master bedroom. Can't go wrong here, a space for everything. I mean, you have king size bed, you have, you can put up to a 120 inch TV up here. You have room for displaying, you know, trophies or whatever you want to display, pictures, family pictures. Um, you do have access to the backyard, which we're going to go out right now. And then you have this sitting area. I really uh, like homes that are uh, master bedrooms that have a sitting area, and, you know, just a place where you can unwind instead of, you know, sitting on your bed or sitting on, on a, just a random couch that's uh, outside your bedroom. You do have a place where you can sit, relax while you, your wife, your husband is getting uh, ready. And it's, it's really, you know, in homes nowadays, it's a, a huge plus to have it. <laughs> of course, you can't go wrong with this view. Massive, massive window. That's the view of good old Rancho Santa Fe. If you aren't familiar with Rancho Santa Fe, look it up. It's one of the most exclusive neighborhoods, not just in San Diego or California, but in the entire nation. I think it was ranked number two in the nation recently. Uh, right behind, uh, there's another place in San Francisco. I can't think of the name right now. Let's go over here to the master bathroom. You have two closets. You have his and her closet. Obviously her closet is a lot bigger, uh, which is quite normal. Beautifully staged home as well. But take a look at this master bathroom. Can you imagine waking up every morning, coming in here, getting ready, getting ready for you know a Christmas holiday party or getting ready for work and really suiting up, you know, whether it's a tie, it's a, it's a suit, it's a, you have a full size mirror on this end. Um, you do have two toilets on each end and then you have a massive walking shower that also is a uh, steam room as well. And I think one of my favorite parts of this master bedroom, which is why I think I like it so much, especially in this house, is what's behind this door. You have a gym. A gym right next to your bedroom. I mean, you can't complain. No excuses to not go to the gym. It's right in your bedroom. You wake up, you put on your gym clothes, and it's right here. You can sweat it out. After you sweat it out, you go into your steam room, you take your shower, you get ready for the day. You can't go wrong. And look at the size of this thing. I mean, you can put weights in here, treadmills, Stairmaster, you name it, you can put it in here. And this is access from the master bedroom. I, I wanna say you almost have access from every single bedroom to come out here. Look at this waterfall right outside your bedroom. I don't know if you could tell from the video, but you do have uh, exterior heaters all up on the roof as well for those uh, cold San Diego nights, which happen rarely, but they do happen. 
Uh, we've recently had pretty cold uh, nights out here. So um, all the backyard, you don't have any real grass. You have turf, which again, saves you a lot of money when it comes to water. I mean, as I said, beautiful pool out here, really deep. Um, and you're overlooking uh, Rancho Santa Fe. I mean, you do have a lot of privacy, but still that doesn't uh, interrupt the view uh, of Rancho Santa Fe. A casita out here, an ADU, a granny flat. So you do have that option out here. Walking in here, this is one of the bedrooms of the ADU. You have your closet and you have your bathroom as well. Good size. If you have guests over, if you have family members over, they can always stay here. You have a movie theater. <laughs> Jesus, this is an amazing movie theater. I mean, come on. Doesn't this house have it all? You have a, an ADU, a granny flat, like six, seven bedrooms, seven and a half bathrooms, under 10,000 square feet. You have a gym, you have a four car garage, you're in a private, uh, you have a private gate, you're in Rancho Santa Fe and you have your own movie theater. I mean, you could sit 20 people in here, watch the Super Bowl, watch the Oscars, can't go wrong. And it just went live and it's listed for $11.1 .1 million, seven beds, seven and a half bath, little under 10,000 square feet out here in Rancho Santa Fe. And that's it guys, that's the vlog for today. Thanks for watching. If you want more information, not just on this property, but in surrounding properties, whether it's Del Mar, Rancho Santa Fe, Coronado, Chula Vista, drop a comment, reach out. My information's on there. See you guys in the next one. Peace.